first module that we really started with was the essential one, the CAD program. CAD allowed us to uh, slip away from the map a little bit. We still needed mapping skills, which by the way, uh, they have a huge program that will allow you to uh, keep up with your vehicles uh, and be able to track where your trucks are because so many times without that communication between the dispatcher and on the field, uh, you know, you can have trucks passing each other uh, uh, when one was closer. Uh, it was a great transition to go from uh, the ability to type in an address and have all the information that you needed at your fingertips. Not only the location, the cross street, but uh, information about that specific business or that home. Uh, the key is kept under the gate by the rock because Mrs. Smith has a heart problem. It saves us a lot of time. It saves us uh, a lot of energy trying to contact people because we have the ability to put those contacts in with that particular address. Uh, you can have a general vicinity. You can put in a zone area and it will get you to that area much, much quicker than having to stop, walk away from the phone, go to a map, and be able to look it up. Uh, there are times when you still have to do that, but the important thing is to serve the people, get them the best service you possibly can. It doesn't ha matter how convenient it is for us. It is just that it is so much, so much quicker for us to be able to get that equipment. We've got rolling hotels on wheels and we've got to get them there fast. So the best way we know how is to be able to use this program, have all the information for the dispatcher to give to the people while they're en route, not 10 minutes after they're on to the scene. Uh, one of the exciting things about working with this program is uh, over the period of years when versions change, uh, it can be very difficult for a seasoned dispatcher to have to start over. And uh, I, I think this is where they really excel. This is where they shine. Codes that we have. The codes are still active in the newer program. Over the period of years, they keep building these codes and colon commands and, and uh, it, it allows the dispatcher who is senior dispatcher that may not be used to the new CAD can reach back, use the old colon codes or commas or uh, uh, period commands and uh, get past it, be able to use it. So that's why it's such a user-friendly uh, program. It allows you to take the old and the new and everything is not thrown out with the bathwater when you come out with a new version. I've been here since November of 1979 and we've seen a lot of growth in that period of time. It's Technology sort of just sat at a standstill for a while. And we had a two-line phone with a piece of paper and a pencil, and that was uh, just about all we had. But as time grew, uh, we needed more, and we demanded more. Uh, we tried some programs off the shelf, uh, and none really fit us well. Uh, we were allowed to, uh, the opportunity with the Alexandria Police to be in on the, a program by uh, ADSI. And over these many years that we've had it, we've had an opportunity to grow. As the department grew, the program grew with us. And it allowed us the uh, flexibility then having to fit our stuff into their mold, we could make the mold and it has been very advantageous for us over the years. Uh, records uh, has been, we've had records because that was a growth period. We got into the records uh, module and it allowed us to keep from having to go three weeks making end of the year reports to the touch of a button and to be able to fit in what uh, uh, titles we needed, what, what information we needed and it was, it was amazing because we sat back and went, wow, this was so easy, something's got to be wrong. So I think the one thing I really enjoy the most about it is the, 
the ability for this program to grow. Uh, they don't hand it to you and say, well, hey, best of luck, it's been great working with you. Uh, a phone call will allow us to be able to work out a problem. And uh, I know sometimes maybe when I, I call them and I say, you know, I really would like this to do this. And they say, let us think about it a second. And they'll call me right back and they'll say, I think we can do that. And uh, that's, that's the difference between something off of the shelf and something that is personalized. And it grows with your department, whether you're a huge metropolitan fire department or a, a small rural department. For more information, email us at sales at e9.com or call toll free 800-730-2374 extension 8553.